Hello, Assalamu alaikum. My name is Nazmul Khan. I'm the instructor for Microsoft PowerPoint. Many of you ask me actually how to make the assignment one. So today I'm going to show you how to make the assignment. So it's going to take around five to eight minutes. You should be able to do your own assignment. First of all, you need to make sure that you have downloaded the, the assignment, the picture and the logo to your computer hard drive. Let's say I have downloaded it my hard drive in download folder so i go here to download it so this is the assignment that i need to make it okay so and i will make this exactly this file and i've also downloaded the logo so i have downloaded in my computer c drive download folder so this is the logo that i have downloaded it okay let me put the logo here yes i will just put the logo almost the same size okay so now what I did actually for these are the text I have already write it in my notepad. So I'm going to copy paste here actually. Okay. So I have this text. I'm going here and control V. So I have this is the text. I wanted to make this text bigger. Okay. Uh, so I want to make this bold and bigger. Okay. Bigger. So I want to make this text here. I am Nazmul Khan and I want to make this on the right alignment. Okay. Yeah. So maybe Nazmul Khan need to be more bigger. So my text is done. So now this is the paragraph I needed. So I've also written in the text file. So I'm going to just copy paste here. So this is the text file that sorry. This is the text file that I already have my biography and up to here yeah so what I want to do is I want to make the font is a bit smaller and up to here to make it a bit bigger okay and right alignment okay so I have my text later I'll change it I also need this 24 share learning which I have written in the notepad control C control V and here I have okay so I'll take the right alignment as well and this one I'll put it here so I need to make it bigger I can just change the font here or I can use control third bucket to make bigger whatever you wish you like it this one I want to change the font color to ash and maybe the learning I want to change to the other font so looks like this always this and I will make it a bit bigger let's say for example this is a 48 or maybe even bigger 54 okay and this one I want to use the orange color select here go to the font color and I will choose the orange color so the text portion is done so now I need to fill up the four box here so first of all I need a circle okay this circle and I want to rotate this circle as a triangle sorry the triangle so I put this triangle here I make it here I make it a little bit bigger this side a little bit bigger yeah so now this triangle I want to remove fill color so when I remove fill color I can't see anything so only the border color you can see now I can go to the fill color take the eyedropper take the existing color so now this color fill with this okay now I can actually remove the outline color so now I have one more box here one more box here another triangle here so I can take this triangle control T duplicate okay I have duplicated it so I can rotate this one and put it here Okay, almost here. I make this. I make it a little bit smaller, and this side a little bit smaller. Yeah, and this one I need to make the black color because bottom one is a black, right? So let me make the black color, shape color, fill color, and choose the black. So this one is done. This one is done. So now I need to do this one and this one. So how do I do it? I take a shape from here. I take the rectangle shape from here I rotate the rectangle shape okay I remove the fill color 
okay outline color I can keep black or whatever I want okay so now I want to put this guy sorry make sure that you selected this box and put this box here okay okay now I need this box a bit bigger and also a bit bigger from the side so now the box going beyond the boundary that's okay it's fine now you go back and select the fill color of this box choose this color and now you can remove the outline color okay done same thing if you select this one you do the control d and this fill color you can still choose from the eyedropper to this color okay now we can rotate this and you can put this one here almost if you un, uh, remove the outline color and choose something different so that at least you can see if this is correct you can rotate if you want and you can make it smaller okay if you want now this color need to fill up with this color so click fill color this color so it's almost like done so you can actually remove the existing picture banner from here remove it yes you have almost done it you can actually just remove the outline color and this one you can just make it like this so just make sure that you have cover everything okay you can take it bigger yeah so it's done so did you see it's 100 percent done your assembly is finished okay you can cut this corner this corner if you want if i want i can show you how to cut it but for now project is completed okay that's what you just need to now you need to go file save as save to your uh, desktop you just write it maybe powerpoint assignment you know assignment g1 as well come i mean you just follow your name that's it if you want to cut it you can also do it using the sniper tool sniper tool just create new click from here to all the way to here just to show your friend that your assignment is perfect you can cut it save it and pass it to your friend to show you that you have done it so our assignment is done that's so simple it is so that's all i hope you like it and it should be easy uh, all of you should be able to do it okay okay see you on the next class thank you